Welcome to Two Way Radio Shop, my name's Neve. In today's video I'm going to be explaining the differences between the five devices in the Moto Turbo R7 series by Motorola. The Moto Turbo R7 series two way radios come in only two hardware forms the non keypad version and the full keypad version. These two forms are differentiated into five different models based on the software configurations and capabilities of the devices. All devices in the Moto Turbo R7 series are licensed two way radios. This means that by law you are required to have a valid Ofcom license to use these devices in the UK. A basic license starts from only £75 and lasts for five years. The five variations of the Moto Turbo R7 series radio are the R7A, the R7 capable non keypad, the R7 capable full keypad, R7 premium no keypad and the R7 Premium full keypad. The first device that we're going to be looking at from the R7 series is the R7A. This is the most basic radio from the series. This radio only comes in the non-keypad hardware version. The R7 is sold as a fixed radio with a limited feature set. This means that it cannot be upgraded by adding license keys at a later date. It is similar to the DP4400 from Motorola previously. Um, the only licenses that can be applied to this radio are the AES256 encryption key and the Capacity Max license. When you buy this radio, what you see is what you get. You will never have access to features like man down, Bluetooth, GPS and Wi-Fi. If any of those features may be required now or in the future, then you are looking at the wrong radio and we would recommend moving up in the series. The next devices in the R7 series are the R7 capable non-keypad and the R7 capable full keypad. These are the mid-range devices in the R7 series. Similar to the R7A, the capable is sold with a fixed feature set straight out of the box. However, it is fully capable of being upgraded via license key. If you need one or two features, this may be a more economical option for you. Or if you want to keep the option open to enhance your device in the future. If you need more than one or two um, features, you may want to look at upgrading to the premium. The last devices in the R7 series are the R7 Premium non-keypad and the R7 Premium full keypad. The R7 Premium is the full package. It comes with all licenses activated straight from the box. Um, the only exceptions to this is the AES256 encryption license and the Capacity Max license. If you need more than two um, features activated on your device, then this is definitely the best radio to go for and you get the most for your money with this device. Um, on the next screen, I am going to display a graphic with the complete summary of all of the um, differences between the models as well as the license key upgrade options available for the devices. Thank you for watching today's video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments down below. If you like the content that we are putting out on this channel, please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.